Friends! How are we? I like this girl, but I don't know how to approach her. Please tell me how I should be a lady killer. What's the setting? You're 17. Oh, and she goes to your school. If you're trying to pick up a girl at high school, I think the best way to do it is to just... Either after school or during, like, recess or something. I don't know. Just at some point, when you guys run into each other, just walk up to her and say, Hey, can I speak to you for a moment and pull her away from the group that she's in? Or if, you know, you can catch her alone, just say, There's something I wanted to talk to you about. And then when she says, oh, what did you need? You can just be like, oh, I just thought you were really cool and was wondering if you wanted to do something later. And then go do something together. And then from there, you can just be like, uh, can I be a bit more honest with you? I think you're more than just really cool. Um, and then do that voice crack that I do. And girls fall for it every time, dude. It's like, cause, cause girls, like you try to approach them and you're manly and tough, and then you put on the the soft, se sensual, uh, childlike, prepubescent voice crack, and the girls just cream their underwear. <laughs> oh, then pull your dick out. <laughs> hey, can I speak to you for a moment? <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Why didn't you say this to Rose? Because it's easy to like say you're gonna do something and then you get real nervous. Show her that dick pic IRL. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take a dick pic and print it out and stuff it into her locker. She'll know. She'll know. Holy shit. Can you imagine opening your locker at school and having a dick pic in there? Wow. Christmas does come more than once a year. <laughs> Amazing! What if other people have the same idea and her whole locker gets flooded with various guys' dicks? Then she has choices, and choices are important in life. I think it's important that she knows she has choices at a young age, you know what I mean? Because she doesn't want to look at one dick pic and be like, This dick pic's the dick for me! You know, she doesn't want to be like that. She wants to look at the dick pic and be like, Ah, so there's more than one dick in this world. And then she can sit there and just, Hmm, do I like this dick? Hmm. And then she can decide, and that's the beauty of the real world. Fuck, I hate girl gamer skins. I hate girl gamer skins so much. Everything's got a fucking glow. Everything's got a fucking glow and go brrrr and Do you remember when they released DJ Sona? Holy shit. What an obnoxious fucking skin. Do you remember when they released Lulu? Honestly, the day I heard transmogulate was the day I disabled voice sounds. I'm serious. Go here. Voice volume. This shit is beyond muted, dude. This shit is negative a billion. Holy shit. Hugeify! Shut the fuck up! Could you be more obnoxious? Alright, chat. Chat, I need- I need chat to fill up with smileys. Everyone smile, we're gonna take a selfie. More- more smileys, team. Everyone in. Everyone in, Twitch chat. Everyone in. Good. All right. <laughs> now I have something to show my mother that I'm not a failure. <laughs> Is that the seller? Yo, Fright Spear. Bit of an update, guys. Fright Spear, if you don't remember, a while back, we had a we had a we had a little reptilian friend named after me, and sadly. Suddenly got out of his cage. I don't blame him. You named them after me, man. I'm, an, I'm a mischievous little fuck. I'm a mischievous little fuck. So, what did we do? Today we got a new Selly, boys. We got a new Selly. He's very cute. Please, for your birthday, stream on Chatterbait playing League without a shirt. Two weeks ago, I saw a chick streaming Overwatch without a bra. Oh, did that get you hot and bothered? bothered? Did that get your boner up? Oh boy. We should- we should host a stream on Chatterbait where all of us just silently masturbate together. What does this stream come to? <laughs> Can you ima- Oh, mama. What happened to the boy you raised? Oh, mama. Mama, he used to be a Lee main, mama. Mama. Mama, he's out there streaming on Chatterbait, masturbating with his viewers, mama. What happened to the boy you knew, mama? Oh, mama! <laughs> the last soldier dying at war. Oh, mama, he goes to raves and takes MDMA, mama. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, mama. What happened to the boy you knew? <laughs> mama, I woke up in a new Bugatti. <laughs> Oh, we have fun on this stream. The dragon's rage, boys. Let's go. Play with him. Play. Cop and do. Woo! Put me in D1, boys. Put me in D1. Take me right up to the top, boys. Take me to the top of the ladder, team. I love it. Woo! Talk about a talk about a Sally Carey. You know what I mean? <laughs> if I do say so myself, team. I uh, I do think this game is for uh, for the least. And I'll chalk that up for a W for the young the young Padawan Sally Bear. <laughs> How did you get your name? There was a really good rogue on World of Warcraft called Cell with two C's, and I thought his name was Cecil, but it was actually just Cell, because he because Cell was already taken, so he put in an extra C, and so I stole his name, and I went on Warcraft 3, and I met a bunch of people, and I went on vent with them, and they all called me Cell, and then that's when I had the realization that my name wasn't Cecil, it was Cell. So when I wanted to be Cecil, everyone called me Cell, and I just played it off because I was too embarrassed to tell anyone, and then I met my, my best friend today, who uh, is my roommate today, um, uh, and he called me a bunch of pet names. So Cell became Selly, became Celebi, became Cellulite, became Sellington, became Sellington the Fourth, Selly Bear, Selly Berry, Selly Barris McLaris, Salad, Salad Cake, um, and also, do you know uh, AWOL Nations? Um, every time this song came up, people thought of me. Let, let me ruin this song for you permanently. Every time you hear this now, you'll be thinking of me. <laughs> can we call you Salad? Yeah, you can call me whatever. <laughs> can we call you Salad? Yeah, you can call me Salad. God. Not like this. Not like this, dude. Oh shit. Oh man. We need some sneak music. Where's my metal slug? Where's my metal slug? We need some sneak music. We got this team. Let's go. Final mission, start! I got this team, I believe. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Mission complete. <laughs> oh, and we got a box. You're great. Oh, we got two boxes. We got two boxes. Sally Berry unboxing video where you give me money and then I spend it to make videos on meaningless content. Enjoy your empty content, team. 
fucking dance game, dude. That Malphite skin is good. It's better than fucking Shamrock, <laughs> where they just put a fucking clover on him and paint him green. Seriously. The amount of- the amount of non-effort that goes into making a Malphite green. Hold up. Let me- let me see if I can- Let me see if I can replicate Malphite. Hold up. Se Detective Selly is on the case. Gonna... Bring this... Right down here. Bada bing. You got your Malphite team. Here we go, Bob Ross with Selly. <laughs> took- took me three seconds flat, team. I love it. Speaking of Penguin, where is he? Um... The other three are out of my hands, and the Penguin's still here. I was gonna give the Penguin away, but my mother was like, You can't give the Penguin away, that's my favorite one. And I'm like, it didn't fucking grow anything. And my mother says, No! I'm keeping this, I'm gonna grow a cactus in it. I said, okay. <laughs> so... So the cactus is en route. I don't know how well a cactus does with a consistent amount of water though, but we'll see how it goes. My mother wants to grow something in it. If my mother can grow something in that and I can't, I'm gonna be peeved though, you know what I mean? I don't want her to be able to grow something and not me. Mommy Berry saved the penguin! <laughs> <laughs> Mommy Barry. There is- uh, we- I have one story from Battle Block Theater. Me and Leon played it together. He's my friend. Me and Leon played, uh, Battle Block Theater together. And there's one motion where you, like, paddle the water towards you because there can be a boat on one side of the water. And to bring the boat over the water to you, you have to paddle the water in. And for some reason, I couldn't think of the word paddle when I was describing the motion. So I was like, do the- I was trying to tell Leon to bring the boat over, so instead of saying paddle, I was like, swiddle swaddle it. <laughs> swiddle swaddle the boat over. And it was the dumbest thing I've ever said, and it, it caught on so hard. That's- that's how we remember Battle Block. That's my fondest memory. Swiddle swaddling the boat. <laughs> uh, good times.